Hello everybody, my name is Abhijit and you guys are watching Roy Detectives YouTube channel and today we have something boring, maybe a special. Okay, so today we have a LED light that can turn on using 220 volt. It's turned on and even it can turn on by human body can look at this even you can turn on using a blade and using a potato there is so many videos are uh, available in the internet i'm not joking guys i will leave some link in the description below i bought this light from local store and when i first time saw this light i'm like wow wow that's a awesome idea and at the time i was sure that inside this bulb there is a battery and this bulb is freaking cheap it's only five dollar you will get around 200 to 250 rupees it's eight odd good light and guys this is the packet this video is not sponsored by this company i bought it from my own money and i like this like i love this light that's the reason i'm showing you and this is their customer care email id so today in this video guys we will tear it down and find out how this thing works before opening the bulb i just want to explain you guys like how this bulb exactly works it's a 220 bulb folder plug it inside and turn it on and as you see guys this two bulb is glowing this other side is this is 100 watt bulb and this side this is 8 watt bulb and as soon as i turn off the light the other light is turned on and if you guys have some power problem you can use this light as an emergency light you can use it tent you can use outside anywhere this bulb is exactly powered by a battery so now let's open the bulb and inside the bulb you will find near about 15 leds and all of the LEDs are connected in parallel and beside those LEDs you will find a proper power supply and a lithium ion battery. The battery is attached inside using a dual sided tape. Let's remove the tape. The battery is a 8650 lithium ion battery which is a kind of expensive battery I don't expect it on this kind of LED. Also there is a proper power supply that's charging the battery as well as driving those LEDs. Those two words for the lining input and this is the inductor coil and I think guys basically it's a 5 volt SMPS and the output to the LED voltage is only 3.2 volt and all of the LEDs are connected in parallel so if one of them is died there will be no problem. And the output line is connected to a 10 volt 220 microfarad capacitor and inside we will find another capacitor it's a 400 volt be careful it can give you a electric shock so the working principle of this led is if there is an input ac voltage the smps convert the ac voltage to dc and feed the leds also charges the battery and if there is no ac but there is a resistance between ac input then it uses a electric relay to turn on the led using battery source and if there is no resistance and no input voltage then led will turn off pretty smart huh to demonstrate this i use a resistance and connect with the input line and as soon as i connect it it turn on the led so it exactly not an human power led it's turned on using our body resistance so guys thanks for watching this video if you like it make sure you smack the like button and if you haven't subscribed to this channel make sure you hit the subscribe button for more upcoming video like this and guys stay tuned meet with you on my next video till then bye bye